screen You're trying to be tough But you are more than I can breathe I told you what I want but was Hi everyone and uh, welcome back to another studio vlog I haven't done one in a while, so I felt like doing that again. Also, I feel like these always hold me accountable to what I actually wanted to do in this week, so I'm gonna try to use this method again to get all my things done because I have a lot to do. As you know, I'm working on a little bit of a bigger project, so that's the main goal for this week. I want to continue doing that. Um, I will show you as much as I can, so uh, this will not be too boring, I hope. And I actually want to clean my desk a little bit. Not cleaning, but rearranging it a little bit. I'm not quite satisfied. Actually, I'm satisfied with how it looks up top, but in the shelves, it's a whole different issue. I don't want to look in there. <laughs> I actually don't even know what art supplies I have, so I'm gonna figure that out and how to display them so I can actually see what I have and not buy like a thousand things that I already have. So that's basically the goal. Working on my project, doing a YouTube video, uh, doing this YouTube video and looking what I can do for my desk to create some inner peace in these shelves. So today, as you can see, it's already a little bit later. <laughs> I wanted to film in the morning. I didn't make it. I slept around four hours today and now I have a headache because I was in English class the whole morning and I still didn't do my homework. Uh, so I will probably do that for the rest of the day. I wanted to film the other YouTube video today, but I feel like with the headache, I will just not do well because I wanted to draw so I don't know, I just want it to turn out well. So I'm just gonna try to do it tomorrow morning. And if I feel like rather working on my project, I'm gonna do that. But for today, I think I'm just gonna um, give myself the grace to go to sleep early and just do my English homework for the rest of the day and read a little bit so I can also finish this book that I've been reading for way too long. Um, so that's the agenda, that's what I'm gonna do today and we're gonna see about tomorrow what I will be capable to do. I hope the headache will be gone when I wake up, I think so, I hope so, so yeah. See you there? Oh. Mm. oh and also I got myself some flowers which I do a lot, actually, quite a lot, but I went grocery shopping early. This is why it took so long to come home and everything. Um, as an adult, it's really hard <laughs> to figure out your, your daily schedule, I feel like. If you have something in the morning, then do grocery shopping, then you have to cook, then you have to clean, and then the day is somehow magically already over. So it's difficult, but <laughs> I'm figuring it out. And yes look at these flowers they they just make me really happy they they are spring so it's gonna be rainy for the next few days so i really wanted to <laughs> have some color in here and i hope that they will accompany me and us through this week so yeah very happy about those and let's move on let's get things started even though it's already late let's do at least a little bit today so i can go to bed at least a little bit proud right so yeah see you
morning um, It's a few days later the most I did was working on my project and I can't film that much so you probably just saw a few shots of that but I'm very happy with how this is turning out so um, I'm trying my best not to go back all the time and think about the things I can improve because obviously since I'm drawing so much right now I'm improving on my way and my professor already told me don't go back and correct the things that you think you improved now so it's hard but it's gonna be a circle that goes on forever if I start doing that. I'm gonna show you like a little thing that I drew. I didn't do the line art yet. I didn't do the colors yet. Um, that's step by step, but just my two little characters that I really love and that are currently struggling on this page because I made them struggle. I feel bad sometimes, but I think every artist with OCD does. <laughs> Because sometimes I'm like, why, why am I doing this to them? But um, yeah, anyway. So today's plan is I will go to Ikea and pick up some stuff. And I hope I can take you with me. And I can film a little because I'm still a little shy to film in public here. But it's, it's Tuesday, it's morning. And I just hope that it's not too crowded. So like... I don't have to watch out all the time to not get random people in my shot. So that's the plan for today. And I'm gonna pick up some stuff and then we're gonna rearrange this mess of a space. I know it's not too messy. On my table there's a lot going on. I actually don't like that, but I also like that. So I'm a little torn right now, but in the shelves. I just really want to rearrange that. So I'm gonna get some things for that and we're gonna rearrange my desk later on and because i know myself i'm probably gonna take a look at the flowers it's not like i have enough already and i'm spending way too much time taking care of them but i don't know i feel like maybe i need more so yeah i probably i probably won't be able to to control myself and when i see flowers i i just naturally pick at least one so let's see how this is going um and yeah let's see each other in the car before i start rambling too much again and we're at ikea i don't know what i'm gonna film next so bye bye i see you there and yeah see you there bye <laughs> Okay, so there's no better way to put you in my car um so you're gonna be a little bit wonky because i'm holding you still so um i didn't film much because i kind of got a little distracted by looking at things and also there were more people that i thought so i didn't film much but i got most of the things that i wanted apart from a mirror that's not important that would have been for my next apartment so it's kind of like just a future thing uh, so I can get it in the future but uh, I got what I wanted for my desk so I'm gonna drive home now and do that and I did not get any flowers which is surprising but I didn't like any of those that were there or more like I liked them but I know that they are too big for my apartment so um, that's the update and I'm gonna try to drive home now because now it's rush hour and that means it's really busy and I'm a little nervous <laughs> so see you home okay so hi I got dressed differently because I want to be cozy and I have to go to the gym soon so this has to be quick um, I'm probably just gonna open this today and try to arrange it because like I said I'm a little late <laughs> I ate too much <laughs> or like too long so um, this is what I'm left with so I got a few of these I want to put some of my pencils in there and I got these because I saw it on one of the like example pieces and I was like that's actually a good idea so I'm gonna use these for some extra 
space if I need it. Also, I use them anyway for my plants, so it's fine. Let's do this. Let's try to arrange it. I don't even know if I have all the tools to arrange this, to put this together. Um, but I'm gonna try my best. I'm gonna find solutions if I need them. And yeah, let's, let's do this. I just used a pin set for that to like screw it in and I didn't think this would work that well <laughs> but it did work it's a bit wonky but I just don't want to go out and buy a screwdriver I'm just gonna wait until my dad visits me and then I'm gonna ask if he can bring a screwdriver to make it like really really tight but it holds well that worked great I don't know <laughs> if you don't have a screwdriver Pin set. I don't know how that works, but it did. <laughs> mm. Okay, so hi. Oh my god, light. Wait. <laughs> hi. Um let me let me put you in your regular spot. Um I almost forgot to tell you about this. I am so excited, uh, I, last year or something, I started crocheting and kind of lost it again over time because wool is really, really expensive and I had other things to do, but uh, every now and then in my free time, I now like to pick it up and especially something about spring is always crochet time. So look what I made. Look at it! <laughs> I'm so excited about that. I know it's getting warmer now, so like there's no way I have I, I can use that. Um, but I have it and I made it. It's a little bit wonky, um, but it's fine. It's like the first thing I ever made. I made like a top uh, last year, but it didn't turn out very well. Like I couldn't really wear it, so um, I probably have to undo that again. So this is the first thing that I actually successfully made. So wait, I gotta open my hair for that. Gotta show you. So look at that. It's so cute. I don't know if I will wear this. <laughs> actually, I already did wear it out. Um, that's adorable. I love it. I wanted to make one of those ever since I saw like Hyunjin wear one of these but I didn't really like the like loosely attached ears and that original hat is very very expensive and I think even though wool is quite expensive especially this one was way too much um, it was still cheaper and I did it myself so I think this is so cute anyway um yeah i like it i'm very <laughs> i'm very very happy that i have that and i'm already making another one actually so this is like um a little bit less thick wool so i don't know how it will turn out um but yeah just wanted to show you that wanted to share it uh i'm so excited i got more wool i got a lot actually and I'm excited to have some ideas and make this in my hopefully some free time soon <laughs> maybe but yeah I don't know I have a new hobby I guess I haven't had one in so long other than drawing so yay anyway uh, see you see you in the whatever I do next <laughs> just wanted to share it it's so cute anyway bye bye <laughs> It's a few
few days later um, I sorted out everything that I could find in my shelves <laughs> and honestly it's not everything I have a lot on my desk and I'm trying to figure out if I should rearrange that and put it in here and also there's a lot of colors I've not used in a long time they're kind of stored very well I just looked at them they're really really dusty um, I should use them again <laughs> I'm a little afraid to use them with the current sketchbook but they are so pretty so I'm a little bit like mad at myself for never using them but I'm aware of them now they, they kind of they're in my field of vision but because they have been there for so long I just forgot about them so I kind of looked over my desk and currently there's a lot of pencils and coloring things on my desk which I wanted to undo <laughs> basically which is why I have that one but first and foremost I want to put everything that was in the shelves in a space like this and if I still have space after that I might think about putting that here because it's a little bit less than I thought there would be because the whole shelf was filled until like the edge and it was full and I could never really find anything but now that it's like laying here I'm like it's not that much actually yeah I will see how much fits here and then I will see how much I take from my desk and rearrange my desk oh and also I for the, for the lower shelf, for now I put my wool in there um, I figured out I should have probably gotten a basket or something for that I thought if I have enough space I could just put them here but I don't think so, I think I will put them in a different place um, but for now I put them here, I will just um, rearrange <laughs> that a little bit oh and also I'm so proud of that, it's like not wonky at all like it it's stable and I I don't know how I did that this is the first time I'm actually putting together any furniture so I did it <laughs> I did it well and it holds up pretty well and I'm really really happy about it it's the color is so nice it fits with a lot of things in my in my um, room because a lot of things are yellow in here I have yellow like blankets on my bed i have yellow uh how's it called um i even forgot the word in german i will put it here i just really like that color and i'm just really happy that i got it so yeah and then it holds <laughs> it's not falling apart so yay so let let me get to like actually assembling the stuff so yeah So that's basically it <laughs> for this studio vlog. I'm quite happy <laughs> because my desk is a little bit more clear and I have this certain space only for my 
art supplies. There are still a few art supplies like behind you right now. I don't quite know where to put them though because I have my little little order <laughs> order. <laughs> Uh, I have my little like system here, so for now it's on the upper place. It's basically just my sketchbooks, those that I haven't used yet. Hopefully I can make a video on that too soon uh, when I'm a little bit less busy with my, <laughs> my current project. But on the upper shelf I just have like sketching things, line art things, uh, pencils, all that. And on the middle one, I have more like the painterly things because I currently don't do that very often. And I like to have my sketchbook art supplies handy because I want to draw in my sketchbook more. I think I said this, say this in every video, but currently it's a little bit busy with having to draw all day for the other things. But finally that space is kind of set and I know what I have now because like I said there's a lot of art supplies even like there on the shelf that I haven't touched in years but now I know I hope I can use them uh, sadly the sketchbook that I'm currently using doesn't really hold watercolors or anything but the other ones that I put there that are not finished they hold watercolors and I'm very excited to try them again oh also let me know uh, if you want to see like a desk tour I know I got asked a few times last year. I'm so sorry for never doing that, but this time I think my space actually is how I want it to be. And before that it was always just a work in progress, so I kind of pushed it away. So if you want to see a desk tour, let me know. I would be very excited to show you around a little bit and show you what uh, what kind of art supplies I have that I completely forgot about. But yeah, it's my little space that I spend basically all my time all day and and therefore I made it very very cozy and very personal so yeah let me know if you want a tour or anything and yeah that's it for this video uh, I hope you enjoyed it I hope maybe you got some inspiration to also clear out some some things maybe you did your desk with me I don't know I would be happy let's not do things alone let's do it together <laughs> Um, but yeah, I hope you're having a great day. I hope you're having a great week and Let's see you again in two weeks. Hopefully and yes See you then. Bye. Bye <laughs>